Hello everyone, welcome, welcome back. So today I'm going to be showing you this salt and pepper chili salmon. It's super, super delicious. I know I say this in almost all my videos, but trust me guys, this is so yummy. I really hope you try this recipe. So with our favourite ado, let's start cooking. So I'm using 400 grams of salmon. I already cleaned it with lemon juice and I descaled the skin. So it's very easy to do this. So it's basically the same way that you descale like saltfish, makayabo. I've got a video on how to do that. I'll try to link it on the description box below. For the seasoning, I'm using salt and pepper. I also have here vegetable oil, some parsley. This is dry parsley. If you do have fresh parsley, then feel free to use that. But this is what I'm using. One loaf of garlic and this sauce that I made. I made this sauce using two tablespoons of soy sauce. One tablespoon of clear honey, about a teaspoon of chili flakes, a teaspoon of cayenne pepper, one finely chopped garlic. Feel free to use a garlic paste if you have some. So I just finely chopped my garlic as you can see. Mix it in, then add a teaspoon of lemon juice. Lastly, I'm adding about a tablespoon of chili sauce. This is not that spicy. I know it looks like I'm adding a lot of spicy things but trust me like mild uh, spicy chili yeah so it's not as spicy so if you do want it spicy i recommend adding scotch bonnet like pili pili um yeah sauce so um to mix it in to make it more spicy this sauce just gives it a nice consistency and it just brings everything together like a good marriage so for my salmon, I'm adding um, salt and pepper only um, because um, the sauce is just going to bring it home together. So just add some salt and pepper um, according to your taste. So this is how much I've added and just coat it in. Make sure that it's all in, as you can see. And what I like about fish, you don't need to season it too much. You don't have to go crazy with it. A little bit. A little bit of seasoning goes a long way when it comes to fish and it's basically how you actually bring it home bring it together uh, is what counts okay and i'm going to leave it aside for about five to ten minutes and um, we're going to put everything together so guys we're going to start frying our salmon i've turned on my heat i've got my pan here and i'm going to add a bit of oil not too much and fry my salmon. So I've got my heat on medium so that it doesn't burn and so this does what we want it to do. But right, just keep checking on there. Every side bit cooks as well, okay? You don't have to leave it for too long. This is salmon, this is fish. Sensitive. Um, it's a really salmon colour. Keep rotating it on every side so that every side get cooked as well. Rotate it on every side. Then I'm going to get my garlic and add it in there. So this just gives it the aroma. So I'll reduce my heat on low. 
my heat on my heat is on low 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 okay so we don't want our fish to be dry so once we give the heat once we start to season up i'm going to start adding my um sauce Pulse like this for a few minutes, about a minute or two, and then she'll be done. Lastly, I'm going to go ahead and add my parsley. And when it's done, et voila, c'est prêt to manger, guys. This was so delicious, especially around the skin area. I felt like this salt and pepper really went in and just literally marinated very nicely. And it was so crispy. It was so, so, so nice. So that is it, guys. I hope this video was helpful to you. Please don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And let me know what you think about this recipe. I'll speak to you soon on my next video. Bye.